yeah. end up on Smashville. Maybe maybe it was requested. Uh, maybe the, the audience wants it. Who knows? Here we go. Either way, this will be a treat. We get to see, you know, uh, one of MSU's rising stars in, in mm -hmm. Dilster, and and then the the uh, ever invader Nam. The the ever present invader. Absolutely. But right now we got a very safe Sheik going in. 22% unanswered so far. Okay, now we're going to get a nice little fair string coming oh no, in from Nam. Um, oh, no. Oh, not getting a jump there? Question mark? But we still have no percent done to Nam. There it is. There we go. You, you asked for it, and there it is. Well, of course, I don't. I really don't want to see a JV3. No, I mean, yeah, no one wants to see that, especially this late in a bracket. And it's back throw, mm -hmm. reads the option, and that's That's, that's it. it. Yeah, there's that's Smashville and Sheik for you. Hey that's guys, like the only time you'll see strike the Sheik <laughs> kill don't above strike or under 100. If you're gentlemaning to Smashville against a Sheik, you might want to reconsider some of your life decisions. Yeah. You basically almost want to lose at that point. So we still see those are going for a lot of the, the uppies out of things, mm -hmm. but now we have a much, much faster character, which is potentially dangerous to be able to get down there and cover the landing, or even mm -hmm. just throw a needle or two. Faster and uh, has the opportunity to play more safely a lot in a lot of cases. And, you know, regardless of what game we're playing, Marth has some difficulty landing, mm -hmm. and Nam's really showing that right about now. Mm -hmm. Yep. He Nam is he, this game one. It's it's looking like all Nam. Yeah, so far, and especially when you Sheik with the lead, you you throw some needles, you chill out. It's mm -hmm. really difficult for Marth to get in. Ooh, almost getting that uh, F tilt into up air. Not quite going to get it. Down tilt. And the bouncing fish reading that air dodge. There we go. And the magic number for Nam. Absolutely. All right. I imagine we are not going to see Smashville again this set. I, I've, I've been wrong before, but after getting killed that early off of the platform, it's uh, unlikely. I don't know. And it does lose your semi, so this should be best of three. Yeah, it's still best of three. And mm -hmm. there we go, Battlefield. I've seen, I've seen Dilster do some pretty nasty stuff on Battlefield before. Mm -hmm. You get the tippers on the platforms. You get, you know, the classic Marth things, which he does quite well. I wonder if we're going to see 60% plus unanswered again for Nam. No, we are not. There we go. Got some up tilts right there from the birthday boy. Oh, no. And the SD. You don't want to see that, but. Uh, this might be a competitive uh, game now. We'll see if. Uh, how the play style changes up. Is right. it, does that mean Nam's going to start rushing in a little bit more? But he was already doing a fair amount of that last time. Yeah, he he has not been playing uh, lame at all. all right, down throw, the up air. air. Uh, keep no. the juggle going. They this are is the tech scrapping the platform. right now. Yeah, that's actually building up a pretty sizable mm -hmm. lead. When Cheeks, no stranger to dying early, especially mm -hmm. if you got someone that hits like Marth. You already see him going for those smash attacks. He's got a stock to play with, so mm -hmm. I don't necessarily blame him. Nope, not at all. And, like, one tipper forward smash is going to do it. Yep. Oh, And there it is, that. tipper uh, neutral B. Almost getting that KO. Trying to turn the situation mm -hmm. around, but we're still boxing. Got the neutral air, and that damage just keeps racking up on Sheik. Mm -hmm. That SD is not... Very not costly. It was a very early SD. Space and the aerial's not quite mm -hmm. at the distance he wants. Now I'm able to sneak in there with a little bit of a forward air. And a fair to respond from Dilster here. And the up smash not Sour. tempering. Let's see how we get down to get this kill. Mm -hmm. It could be difficult for, for Sheik on Battlefield. Got the larger blast and the, zones. The up throw almost getting a quite. kill. How many kill sparks have we seen from Dilster this game? I think <laughs> three? <laughs> There's been some, that's for sure. There was the neutral B, the neutral air. And now the up throw. That, not enough. Battlefield. Oh, and he gets the yep. air dodge read. Not impossible. She right. can do some things. She scales better with rage than people give her credit for. The only downside is now we are very close, if not already, an up throw kill percent. Especially with uh, the palm war too. Oh, mm -hmm. interesting. You can go anywhere from that move. Mm -hmm. Uh, and the jab to forward smash starts becoming a real thing at very high percents. And there it is. All right, so the JV2 with the assist from the, uh, the, the SD. SD assist, yeah. Yeah, it's unfortunate. Well, you won't be seeing uh, any more of that in uh, a couple months because 
Side B no longer sends Sheik into free fall. That's good. Is, yeah, also, so uh, we'll have a three stock game most likely. So well, most likely. Then again, anytime you're throwing away a stock, it's it's a bad place to be. It's a bad look, but if you throw away 33% of your stocks versus 50% of your stocks, that's a better look. Absolutely. I mean, you're completely right. But now here we go. We're back to an even an even game. Game three. We see a lot a lot of safety. Mm -hmm. Probably gonna. Yes, the, there's there's more on the line now because now we don't have Nam with that game to play with that he did at the yeah, start. Yeah, Nam doesn't have a safety game. game. But assuming he doesn't SD, I think this could be a very competitive game number three because it looks like Dilster started to figure some stuff out as well. That's true. We're probably not going to see a lot of Beer versus Needles off stage. <laughs> probably not. Let's him back on, but reads the air dodge back onto the stage and gets a nice fourth or bouncing fish. Nam doing a good job extending his lead just a little bit. But that up tilt puts him in a bad spot. This delayed recovery, make sure he doesn't get F smashed at the ledge. That's no fun. Mm -hmm. Ooh, and the up breaking him out. And we're dead even here. Mm -hmm. We're at 70 some odd. Now we're actually dead even. 76 apiece and two stocks. Off stage, Sheik so hard to keep at the ledge, so hard to edge guard. And Ooh. the tipper forward smash, That'll that's going to do it. Do it. That's so that's the first stock going uh, Dilster's way. Yeah, absolutely. And now we, I mean, rack up damage all you want, but if you're down a stock, you're you're down half the game. Mm -hmm. Whiff in the grab, but whiff, jab, jab. Oh, and, and there you the go. Up smash. Up smash. There we go. That was one too many uppies. Yeah, it's, yeah, you can't do that forever against state PR players. Right. That's for sure. But he's he's holding his own. He is scrapping right here. Absolutely. No matter no matter what the venue is, it's always a good time when you can take a player of the caliber of Nam to game three and possibly take that game number three. I know. I mean, Dilster, freshman here at MSU, we have him around for for quite some time. He is literally the future of uh, MSU Smash. <laughs> it's, it's really good to see. And looking for that neutral, that can lead to the, so much stuff for the Sheik. Out Again, it's really been his his. You know, it's panic working. Button. It's it is working. So it's the air dodge read doesn't quite have the alignment for it. And right here we got the jab into side B. That's a lot oh. of damage. One of those eye frames. <laughs> oh mm -hmm. boy. Nice air dodge from Nam. Oh, uh, those two rolling together. Yeah. Dilster known for swinging a bit. He's really swinging now. Mm -hmm. Hey man. You can't hit a home run if you don't swing. <laughs> that's, that's true. I mean, pretty soon, you know, just a nice single on the left is going to do it enough to <laughs> kill Sheik when you're at 91 with a little bit of Sometimes rage Sometimes you just not need that walk-off single. That's all you need. Ooh, and he Greedy. power shields it. I wonder what the optimal, like, punish you can actually get there for Marth based on that spacing as well. Because, like, he was right up on the body. Mars ledge trapping, no joke, even mm -hmm. if it is on Sheik. Getting back to the center of the stage with that bouncing fish. Oh, forward smashing in the wrong the direction. Greed. And the vanish! And that's going to do it! He did. He died hey. from the greed. But that's what you got to do sometimes. Yeah, sometimes you got to go for it, especially, you know, it's trying to catch Sheik. Mm -hmm. If she gets a bit of a lead, can be a real problem. Even